Hi, <clears throat> this tutorial is about Compass and we're going to make our menus like for instance Sublime Text here we're going to make it uh, here transparent in, Com in Compton, yes, we can set menus to be transparent so I wondered, can you do the same with Compass? Yeah, you can it's hidden somewhere in one of these little icons and I believe it's in here in opacity, brightness and saturation so we've activated already opening it and checking it out at this point in time does not help as you see but we should do something more so clicking here we can increase opacity and brightness, saturation and all that we want to talk about the opacity so which is tra transparent so windows specific settings windows windows okay let's take a new one and let's move this one over here if we can so this is the wibbly wobbly of compass and we have to decide what kind of uh, menus will will uh, get this and for instance we can decide to this, the menu only the menu items will receive a transparency of 90 so 100 is not transparent 90 is a little bit less transparent, 0 is invisible. So, okay, 90, close. We have this line here. Let's check it out, what happens. Uh, maybe not yet visible. If we do this, not yet, I guess not. So, uh, close without saving, of course. But at some point, it will be uh, active and you can add as well. Let's do that before we check it again. Uh, we should also do two, for instance. Um, oh, yeah, my mistake, I guess. We have to call it drop down menu. Probably that's the name of the thing we just tested. Drop down men menu. We can make it uh, 80 or 90. So we can have different transparencies for different items so menu drop down menu what else uh, topics for topics are there more uh, like um, tooltips we have sometimes tooltips and we can set the tooltip to be 90 again of course you can add uh, all of them also together like so tooltip and then this large bar menu which I'll post like this on my website. Pop up menu and drop down menu. No problem, you can do this as well. If, if of course, you want to, want to have the same transparency for all of them. So that's also a possibility. You don't need to do it all by yourself. But if you want to decide to have this one a little bit more transparent than the other, of course you need to. So otherwise I was only missing this one I think that's the one that's not in there so copy and close I'm gonna delete this one again and this one is now entered as well so we have the menu we have the drop down menu we have the tooltip and we have the pop up menu and we've set different well most of the time different uh, elements and now we can take a look at all of these elements and you see here transparency has kicked in so i guess this is called the drop down menu as you can see you can see through it so these are the little elements that you can do to change your compass your compass uh, opacity and here it is to change it 